Okay. Alright. Great. So, um... I literally just replayed the entirety of the first two chapters to get back to the third chapter because I went through the entire chapter in preview mode which means it wasn't recording because I'm an idiot anyways welcome back to room two um, chapter three was surprisingly very easy so I'm just gonna kinda go through it uh, I'll read the notes and I'll, I'll try to get through it as fast as I can um, there wasn't really a whole lot of me fumbling around in it so I mean you know you didn't miss much, but now you get to watch me try to remember everything that I did. Uh, right, it starts like this. So this is unsettling. Um, there's this symbol here. I don't like that, but I'm going to take this metal bar and this is going to go and fall down, right? Okay, so I remember this much. Um, a lot of this is, is really, really straightforward. So, I just do that, flip this, this opens up and gives me a thing, I'm not going to need that for a while, um, I can grab this, um, I don't have that yet, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to blaze through this and do the next chapter as well, uh, I think. So, when there's a handle here. So, as you can see, there's a crossbow that's like mostly not there. Um, so, I'm going to try to find all the pieces to the crossbow. I think that's the first thing I need to do. Um, ah, a note from A.S. Another room, another door, another room. Either you are as lost as I, or more likely you have forsaken me. Another room, another door. Yet never a pang of hunger, nor the welcome respite of sleep. Another door, another room. I keep a tally in my ledger. But I can no longer count the marks. I count the pages. The writing keeps me sane, I tell myself so. I did not deserve this hell. A.S. So, A.S. is definitely having a bad time at this point. Um, I really don't know what specifically he's doing. But, um, whatever it is, he's having a bad time. Uh, there's something here, right? Yeah, okay. So I'm gonna need to remember these symbols for later. Um, where the hell is the last piece to the crossbow? You would think... Oh, right, I remember. Um, so I've got this handle. Um, so I can do th this puzzle. Um, real easy. This opens up. Okay. And gives me the trigger mechanism. So, something that I got really confused about the last time I did this was these pegs, because I forgot that's where I got this. Um, so the trigger mechanism can now go on here. And I can string it up. And that'll flip up. And this'll open. Yeah, alright, so, um, we got this hint over here, pierce the eye, um, so I guess I'm gonna do that, uh, I have a crossbow bolt already, so let's load it, load it, thank you, and let's, uh, go ahead and, 
God damn it. All right. That was my bad. I'll accept the blame on that one because it was definitely my bad. Um. Pachoo! So, I forgot what that does. Right, it reveals this set of puzzles. Um. Okay, so there's a puzzle here that is really dumb. So, basically, I have to get this into that. But. Uh, the trick is that this slides back and forth, and it's the only way to solve it. Um, otherwise, the, the enemy piece will just eat you every time and you lose repeatedly. So that gives me this key. There's a note here. I see a once mighty people brought low by these heathen invaders and their plagues. They look to their priestess for the will of the gods, but the jaguar and the feathered serpent speak to me no more. The crystal of our ancient mothers is being summoned. I would speak to them. Uh, I have no idea what that's about. Uh, I don't think I'm supposed to have any idea what that's about. So, let's open this box. Um, which... I forgot what's inside. Oh, right. Large stone block. Uh, I'll have to come back to this box later. Because there's a couple indentations and nothing I can do with them right now. So, this is a thing. So, let's... Repeatedly... Slam this into that until it breaks. All right, yeah. So that gives me a shard of glass, and this is this is a really cool puzzle. So you'll notice that 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 gold box there is definitely not the same box. Um. So I there were two symbols. These two. And now the boxes will swap. Uh, cause, you know, that's definitely not unsettling at all. Uh, and I think the note's the same. Yeah, the note's the same, just the box changed. Um, put this here. This opens and gives me a, an ornate ancient dagger. Um, there's something else I need to do here, though. Um, yeah, so this will open this door, and it'll lead to a bunch of perspective puzzles, because this game really likes perspective puzzles. Start off real easy, and, uh, I don't... I don't know if I remember how to do this one. Um, right, here we go. Oh, right, there's only the two. Okay, so that gives me that sequence of symbols. Which, I, if I think those are the two that I need, uh, it's what, 2S? Uh, 2X was the way that I remembered that. Uh, I just want to get through this. I, I still feel so stupid for, like not double checking that it was recording but um i mean it happens from time to time so just unfortunate that it happened with a puzzle game where i'll remember most of the puzzles so i think this yeah this gets me uh this guy here and this so now that i've got that there's this back here which points out three uh 
three ja uh, X's that mark the spots or whatever so let's uh Let's carry on and just get through this. I press those three and I get some flint. So, here's another note. I see past lives, future lives, impossible lives. So, um, I, I have no idea what the notes are about. I really wish I did, but, you know, not really much to it. So, something that I, I didn't look at earlier is that it smells like burnt straw down here. I have a straw guy and a piece of flint. So, let's, let's ignite that. So now I can actually shoot a crossbow bolt into this. Uh, come on, let me do it. Okay, great. I am as I am blind as my reflection. Our gods do not live here. This way brings no salvation. This path is not for my people. I shall seal them from it. And I I, I really just I I don't know. I don't know what you're getting at, but um I don't like it. So this gets me this thing. Um, I didn't really mention what I was doing there, but it doesn't take long. So, this is a puzzle where you need the, th the uh, there we go. So you basically just line up all the pins and then rotate it around and you get Ugh, a creepy skull that I still was unprepared for. So the skull will go on this, and then if I activate this thing, it'll split it right in two and give us the thing that we need. Okay, I, I remember this, and I don't like it much. <laughs> um, okay, there we go. There we go. There we go. Alright, so, that was chapter 3. Chapter 3 was, uh, honestly, even knowing everything, it was, it's just a short chapter. Uh, even, even when I did, went through it the first time, it only took me maybe maybe five minutes longer than this one did there wasn't a lot of a lot of questions um, so I'm gonna switch over to my normal profile so that I can um, you know finish I can continue this episode over there so I'll be right back okay and we're back chapter four uh, puts us in this room um, we're 100% back in uncharted territory, which is good, because uh, I really did not want to have to do that, but um, I didn't want you guys to miss out on any content that this game has to offer, just because I'm an idiot. Like, it's, uh, you know, I, I don't want that. So, I figure at least 
the way that I did it is better than nothing. What is this? What is this? What? Uh, okay. Well, I don't know what to do with you, so... What do I do with any of this? What do I do with anything? Does this open? Yes. A note from AS. If you are here, then my travels have not been in vain. If nothing else, my promise to you gave me purpose. If I was damned for trapping you here, then now I offer you my redemption. Finally, I hold the key. The secret to this world of worlds, this place of endless places. With it, you may lift the veil, peek behind the curtain. We do not have to take the path that is offered. A.S. Oh boy. Uh, well, I don't know what he's on about, but there's um, a, a piece of paper. Whoa, stop that. That startled me a little bit. Maggie Cox, 17 Franklin Court, London, E7. For Simon Grayson, a.k.a. the Great Khan, what has become of you? You know, I can tell when you're lying. I was the only one you could never fool. I know you have it. Have you started playing without me? It sounds magnificent. This press man isn't going to leave me alone, and you owe me... And you owe me, you sow. Since when can you resist putting on a performance, we'll be pioneers. I'll be at the line at 9 o'clock. You'll be there. I know you. Mags. Uh, I have no idea what that's about, but the... What the fuck? Okay. Uh, well, as I was saying, I have no idea what that's about. Um... Oh, okay. 5th March, 1883. Miss Margaret Cox, I'm writing to you for the final time before I begin the proceedings I have brought to your attention since your brother's disappearance. You have attached yourself to my mother like a leech. For her sake, I would prefer this to be quiet. But you are a charlatan and a fraud, and I will expose you as such if I must. Leave her be, or else the paper has offered me a full page. Robert Bailey, a viewfinder. Temple ship time null. Death home science stairs. What? What is with this? Okay. Uh, I think the viewfinder. Okay. Um. Great. So I can attach a viewfinder, which does what? Uh, a small metal handle. Oh, uh, I know where this goes. I know where this goes. Okay, uh, this is good. This is good. I'm making making progress. Or do I? I don't know where this goes. Okay. I do not know the purpose of that either. That's the letter. Oh boy. Oh. Uh... You don't go there either. Where does this go? I want in there. Ah! 
Fine. Um. Okay, uh, that's, that's great, this, this did its thing, but, to, to what end, what, what was the purpose of that? <sighs> Wait, hold on, there we go, uh oh, I don't like the thing I just did. Whoa! No! No! You stop it! That's rude, and I will be having none of that. Infinity. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Two. There's a two. Two. I don't. I'm not sure I follow. Uh, some drawers. The drawers are all locked! Crap. Um. Okay. So, what do I do about that? Come on, something, something here. Something's gotta give, right? <sighs> Wait, what are you? Another keyhole? I don't have a key, though. And this thing just stopped working on me. So, what do I do? Infinity, I don't, I don't know what I'm supposed to... Button is missing something, thanks, I could have guessed. Uh. Um. Just, just for my own sanity, okay. Okay. That was a lot spookier the first time. Uh, alright, um, well, can I, can I look over at the fire? No. Can I, can I look at anything else random around the room? No. There's got to be something that I'm missing here. Uh, I think that this thing shouldn't have broken. Maybe that's part of my problem.
Uh, okay, so I still don't have a key. Um, and like, there's a bunch of stuff that uses a key, right? Uh, 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 the key. Alright. Um,. There we go. This will open up and oh, good lord. Uh. Alright, well, let's go ahead and uh, unlock this next. There we go. Alright. So then these all slide out and do this thing and okay. That was actually like a really cool mechanism. Weird, but really cool. Oh boy. And there we go. That wasn't too hard. There's uh the Star's Tarot card. Okay. All right. All right. Well, I'm getting somewhere now. Um So, okay. Uh that one stays where it is. This one goes out like that. You just stop moving that. Stop. 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 Oh boy. Um There we go. Alright, so that was like the worst ever, but I think I'm done with that key, so... Okay, so I got this thing. I think this goes here. Which opens up and gives me a long metal lever, and I think this goes on here. Ah! Ah! Um. I. An. F. I. N I T Y Infinity Right? That's that's what you wanted. All right, well I don't know if that's what I'm supposed to do there, but um, I'm going to stick this light bulb in here and turn it on. <clears throat> oh, God. Oh, uh, boy. Okay, that was 
super weird. This is fine. Let's put stars down. I I do not like this. Oh boy. Like I I know it's not a horror game, but like I definitely am still off put. We began at home staring at the stars. So much to discover, so little time. Okay, we began at home staring at the stars. So much to discover, so little time. We began at home staring at the stars. I misread stars as stairs earlier, didn't I? Ugh. Alright, um... Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Uh-oh! Oh boy. Voyage. Voyage. Oh, 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 I know, I know, I know. It wants me to do this. Okay. Please stop making weird noises behind me. I am easily perturbed. Voyage. Countless ships bore us triumphant to a hidden temple. It was at home. You proved a shallow friend. Okay, uh, so that, that makes sense. Ship, temple, home. Here we go again. Oh boy. Ugh. It could literally keep giving me words to do this over and over and over again for a while. Endless. Oh boy. Endless. Under these alien stars, I courted only death. I don't have death! I am saved by science. My muse. Up, up, down, up, down, 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 up. Up, up. Up, up, down, up. Down, 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 up. Okay. Alright, uh, that makes sense. So, stars, death, science, right?
Ah, oh, here we go again. I don't like it. Oh boy. Hope. Okay. All right. I just want to go home. I've been in all these weird rooms solving weird puzzles and it's all weird and creepy and I don't like it. The null graced me with time for a dozen lives worth uh, work. Now death returns to take him to take his due. I don't have null though. Where do I get null? I have to be missing something, right? Cause like that, I have stuff for over here, but I I can't open this. And the, the same thing is here. And I, I can't do anything with that either. I don't have the null card. Wait. Okay. All right. That's fine. You could just be like that. I, I, I had an inkling that maybe the null card was just supposed to be a blank space, but it's not. Um, I'm just dumb. Uh, there's, there can't be anything else here, right? I, I really don't know what else I could possibly need to solve over here. Um, cause like, I, I don't see anything, dude. This room is way harder than the last one. If I'd realized it was going to be this hard, I might have actually made this its own episode. Um, but I can't stop now. I've traveled so far. Where can I find the null card? I get the feeling that it thinks I'm supposed to have- oh. Hello. Uh, I have a small bell. So, what about that? Ah! I have a bell clapper. Ah! Yes! Okay! That gives me a brass dial. Okay. Um, but more importantly, I can open this now. Decorative plate. Oh, Jesus. Don't, don't, don't. Don't do that to me. Con. Well, okay. That's that's great, great, good, good. Uh. Okay, I see. Let's 
So that'll open this, which will give me the null card. Yes. Yes. Null time death. And, uh, oh boy, 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 all of that seemed very unnecessary. Oh god, what is happening now? Oh, he dead, he dead, oh, he dead and here, oh god. Um, okay. Okay. An ornate key. What do I do with it? Oh, I know. So this will open up and yes. Okay, so there's... Has it always looked like that? That's not the same. Oh, what? What is... Okay, alright, so, um, that, that was chapter four, uh, the seance, and, uh, I, I have absolutely no clue what just happened. Uh, the very end of that was different from every other, uh, room's ending so far, so I... I really want to know what's happening, but it's getting late, <clears throat> so we'll have to find out what's going on in the next episode, clearly. So thank you all for tuning in, and I will see you all in the next video. See ya.